There we go. All right, I think there we go. I think it's working now. Hello, hello, everybody. Let me just start this recording. Hey, Double Exposures, how you doing, man? Ice Boy, how you doing? E. <laughs> Alright, while this is loading, I need to go shut the door. I'll be right back. Alright, let's see here. Hello, Flipper. You're about to play the House Flipper 2 demo. Follow the quest list to transform a rundown shack into a beautiful house. When you're done, you can keep playing and add some personal touches to it. Look out for books placed around the house. They will tell you how to use your tools. Happy flipping. All right. All right. So here is my house. They just... <laughs> good. All right, good. I'm glad you're doing good, man. I'm getting a call from Tom Marino. Let's see. Hey, hey. Hello. So, how do you like the house I found for you? Beautiful, isn't it? So beautiful. You know, this is a new game. <laughs> Uh, exactly as I pictured it. Uh, what's going on here? <laughs> you said you want to try your hand at house flipping, right? So I found you a house and organized transport. You're oh, wow. welcome, by the way. Now all that's left to do is the renovation itself. I hope you'll have fun making the house look amazing. <laughs> okay, well, I guess. How did you even find this um, house? <laughs> it's been listed on the market since forever, I think. We even made a bet with other agents on who will find a buyer first. And now I have the upper hand. My personal house flipper. <laughs> so thank you. I can't wait to see how the house will turn out. Okay. <laughs> yeah, me neither. And that's the beauty of it, isn't it? <laughs> the unpredictable challenges, the unexpected outcome. I'm sure a house like this has tons of mysteries. Good luck with it. Tons of mysteries. Okay, well, so I've been dumped here on this this island, it looks like. Uh, Pina Cove. <laughs> I've been dumped here on this island, and I've been tasked with uh, flipping this house. So I played the first House Flipper for a little while, and I received a free copy of this game, House Flipper 2. And I thought it would be just kind of fun to, to just chill and play this game with you guys. So if I hold down the right mouse button, I've got all these different options. Let's see what I can do here. I got this flipper tool, which if I recall, yeah, lets me sell junk. So things that I can sell, I can uh, I can click on it and sell it. Man, this place is a is a trash pile. There's so much junk. But now there's some things like these garbage bags. I think that I have to pick them up. Yeah, okay. And I imagine, yeah, I just throw them in the trash. Let's see if I can. Uh, Make a shot. No, <laughs> I can't. Can't make a shot. Let's see. Let's try that again. Ah! <laughs> I'm not a basketball player. <laughs> I'm not going to be playing NBA 2K anytime soon. Oh my goodness. Come on, get in there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I can do that. Uh, can I pick this trash can up? Can I sell it? No, I can't sell it. Oh, there's more trash. Okay, so if I go over to this, I can collect the trash. And it looks like I'm filling up trash bags. But not everything is trash. So there's some things that I can sell and some things that is just trash. I'm kind of scared to go into this house. This house looks just trashed. But it's my job to fix it up, right? <laughs> Any more trash out here? Can I go up on this scaffolding? I can, okay. No trash up here though. Oh man, look, there's the upstairs. Uh, I can pick stuff up inside the house. <laughs> Is there fall damage? No, <laughs> no fall damage. All right, so I'm gonna get out my little, uh, my little tool here again and just start selling stuff that's worth money I can sell. Ch -ch 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 -ch. 
Hey, Phil, Phil Lyles. Kids all love all your content. Thanks, man. We're usually watching some two camp play. That's awesome, dude. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. What are your kids' names? I'll give them a shout out. I hope they enjoy this game. You know, I'm, I'm kind of taking a bit of a risk because I usually do monster truck stuff. But I wanted to just chill and relax tonight. And I think this is kind of a, a fun little chill, way to chill. Cleaning up all the trash in this trashed out house. There's so many pieces of wood that's just kind of lying around. Oh, okay, so these, these windows are all boarded up out here, too. I can sell that. Oh, looks like I can sell... Who would want to buy the weeds that are growing on the, on the house? I don't know, but I can sell them. All right. We're cleaning up the yard pretty good here. Do we dare go inside? What do you guys think? Is it time? Should we go inside? Brady and Declan. Brady and Declan, how you doing, guys? Thanks for watching my videos. I appreciate you. Hope you guys are having an awesome summer and an awesome night. Stay cool. It's I know down here in Dallas, it's super hot. I don't know what, how, what the temperature is where you guys are at, but... Here in Texas, it is hot. There we go. My boys went to the pool yesterday. And I think they're going to try and go again uh, tomorrow. Man, look at the graffiti. And then, what is that? <laughs> oh, yuck. Uh, okay, let's open the door. And see the inside here. Uh, eat open. Oh, Yuck. I can't even imagine what this would smell like. Somebody left their slippers. <laughs> uh, okay, so I, I can't get in. Oh, I know. So I'll just... There we go. I'll just sell the wood. There's lots of wood to sell. <laughs> I'll sell the slippers. <laughs> uh, apparently this coat rack is no good anymore. This looks trash. Trash. I don't know. Okay, so all these books I think are tutorial books. But, like I said, I played the first one, so I think I'm okay. Apparently, this radiator is okay. Why you would need a radiator on a tropical island, I don't know. But apparently it gets cold at night here. Oh, that painting needs to go. <laughs> Good. I'm so glad. I'm glad it made their night. Southern Ontario. Wow, okay. And it's still pretty warm there. <laughs> I bet it gets cold in the winter, though. A lot colder than it does here. <laughs> That's great. Uh, selling off every look at this kitchen all these cabinets man this is what happens when you don't take care of your stuff <laughs> there's garbage everywhere this oven is all rusted out look at the tea kettle selling all the cabinets let's get rid of it all <laughs> who would want to buy these dirty rags <laughs> oh man some mason jars. Maybe those mason jars are worth some money. Apparently they are, because I'm selling them. A bread box. You know, it doesn't look half bad once you once you get rid of all the junk. Yeah. Well, that, I can sell that. There we go. Jennifer, hi from Canada. Nice, another Canadian. My sons, Logan and Jojo, love watching your Monster Jam Steel Titans. Thanks. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Logan and JoJo. I appreciate you guys. Thanks so much for watching. What's your favorite monster truck, guys? Let me know. What kind of... What's your favorite summer activity? That's what I want to know. What kind of things do you like to do up there in Canada? It can't be all uh, ice skating and hockey, right? <laughs> so much stuff to sell. You know, this this house really doesn't look that... Well, I say that as I look at some <laughs> nasty green gross stuff up here. Let's get out the brush and start scrubbing some of this stuff. Nice. So we can clean that right up. 
Look at all that. It comes right off. It, it doesn't really look half bad. It's kind of satisfying. What else can we clean? We'll clean the graffiti off this wall. I think it's funny that just a little bit of cleanser and a rag can just uh, clean the graffiti right off. Wish it was that way in real life. Yeah, there we go. Looks so much nicer. <laughs> What's going on, Double XP? I know that you you are so excited. We did have some fun playing some uh, Lego 2K Drive together, huh? That was fun. We'll throw all this trash away. Oh, my trash bag is full. Let's throw that right out the door here. Let's see if I can make this shot. Oh, I made it. <laughs> JoJo's favorite is El Toro Loco, and Logan's is Gravedigger. Man, both of those are awesome trucks. Those are definitely in my top ten for sure. Gravedigger has got so many different models. So many different variants. What's your favorite color of Gravedigger? The original? Oh, like I know in the uh, for the new World Finals that's coming out here in a couple weeks... They have a, a pink one for Kristen Anderson to drive. That'll be exciting. Cleaning up all of this trash. Looks like that lantern down there is something I can uh, sell. There we go. Sell this rotten plant. I don't know who would want to buy a dead plant, but somebody does. And it looks like I can't I can't pick this little stuff up. What else do I have here? Oh, I've got a vacuum. I can vacuum this stuff up. There we go. Nice. Vacuum up all the little glass pieces that are broken. Max D is definitely in my my top favorites. Top 3 for sure. Yes. Double XP, I know you love Max D. I know he is your favorite. Nice. Floor's looking pretty clean, although right here, this flooring, it looks like it's pretty thrashed. I think I'm going to have to... Can I pick this up? Oh, I need to hold that down. There we go. Now I can pick it up. I'm going to put this right here in the windowsill for right now. Yeah, there we go. Painting for beginners. <laughs> there we go. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> yuck. Let's clean this ceiling off. There's so much gross stuff. Who who trashed this place? Why? This house is in paradise. Why would you trash it? <laughs> Jennifer, oh, they went to they went to a Monster Jam show in Vancouver in March and they loved it. Man, I'm so jealous. I had an opportunity to go to the Monster Jam show here in Dallas back in March, and I didn't go, and uh, I'm kind of sad. They have another one coming in October. I think I'm going to try and go to that one, but that's awesome. I'm glad you got they got to go. I have not been to a modern-day Monster Jam show. The last Monster Jam show I went to was in the mid-'90s, so I need to I need to make an effort to go to the next one in October. Cleaning up the floor. Yeah, it really doesn't look half that bad when you uh, when you clean it all up. Nice. Okay, so now we got this big old hole in the wall, and I think there's a way that you can. Can I take this whole wall out? No, I can't take the wall out. I think that would look better if I took. The oh, I can take this wall out though. Oh yeah. There we go. That's satisfying. Hiya! <laughs> Don't do this at home. <laughs> there we go. Give it a good swing. Yeah. Yeah, this wall definitely needs to go. We need an open concept kitchen. What about the frame, though? Can I get rid of the frame? Or is the frame just stuck there? <laughs> uh. Uh. <laughs> 
Double exposure, you're not enjoying the game? I'm sorry, dude. I'm having fun with it. I, I don't know. I was looking for something fun to just chill by. I'm sorry, it doesn't look fun. The pit party is worth it. Okay, so I'm definitely gonna go. Chocolate Drive, what's going on? I'm glad you're here, man. I definitely, that that's on my to-do list. If I, When we go, I'm definitely gonna get the pit party as well, because I definitely think that would be worth it. There we go, cleaning up the windows. You know, double exposure, I, I think you're, you're right, cleaning is not all that fun, but this is kind of, it's satisfying to, to take this house that was once just trashed and make it nice and clean again, you know? You gotta, you gotta look at the end results, right? What does it look like when you're all finished? See, like, look at those windows, they're all sparkling clean now. <laughs> there we go. How about these windows? Oh yeah, these need to be cleaned too. Ew, there's all kinds of green gunk on this one. Oh yeah, nice. I missed it. I missed the RRC family one. I need, to, I need to sign up for one of their sign-up series one of these times. Okay, so I think I can build this wall up. There we go. Yeah. Nice. And we go up. Let me fill this wall in. And there we go. All right. So now I've got this wall. And the, you know, the room looks... Uh, hey, what? Where did all this stuff come from? <laughs> I need to vacuum it all up again. Uh, <laughs> double exposure, you like breaking stuff, huh? You don't like cleaning, but you like breaking stuff. Oh, man. Fun fact, this is what our business... In our business, this is what we do. Post-construction cleanup for house flippers. Nice, dude. So, do you feel uh, right at home watching this? Or you got any tips for me? <laughs> Feels like you're at work right now. <laughs> That's funny. I bet you wish it would go this fast, huh? <laughs> Jennifer, you love the first house. You know, I played the first house flipper for a little while, maybe like two or three hours. I didn't play it for long enough. Uh, but I've been enjoying this one a lot, actually. So I've got this builder tool. I don't know what to do with it, though. I think I need to. Whoa! I think what I need to do is I need to replace these floorings by scraping them up here. There we go. <laughs> this is kind of... Ah, I, maybe I shouldn't be standing on it. <laughs> hey, thanks a lot, Double Exposure. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> you wish it was this this quick and easy, huh? <laughs> That's funny. All right, let's see. Yeah, I, I do too, Jennifer. I like cozy games too, and this this definitely is. It feels like a cozy game. All right, so now I need to I need to buy. No, this isn't this isn't right. I need to get the right materials to put on this. Uh, set finishing borders no flip flipper sense. What does that do? Oh Okay, so I know that these also need to be replaced over here. I could tell that But I need to buy some material for it, and I don't really know how I wonder if Well, I'll just I'll just pull all these up off the floor all these tiles all the bad tiles <laughs> See, double exposure is what we do after we, we fix up the house, then we stage the house, and then we sell the house, right? 
When we get to the staging part, I bet you're going to like it because then we buy furniture and stuff like that. Uh, let's see. Chocolate Drive. I would say do the demo work first. Oh, the demo work first to clear the space and then rework everything, clean up last. For sure. So this is, this is uh, you know, I've already kind of demoed out this wall. I don't think there's a whole lot of demoing that goes on. Whoops. I don't think there's a whole lot of demoing. I think this, I, I watched another streamer um, play this game. So I, I think that uh, there's not, you're limited in what you can do, basically. So, but I need to be able to, aha. Okay, here we are. Oh, okay. I can sell, I can sell that door frame. Yeah, see, here's all the furniture that I need to buy to stage. Paint to paint the walls, and on this, yes, this is, yep, this is it. Okay, so this is what I need to buy. There we go. Now I can uh, fill in my flooring. <laughs> it's not exactly a clean fit, but uh, yeah, it works. It's like fitting together Tetris pieces. There we go. Okay, and then I'm looking at the bottom. It says change size. Oh, that is so much easier. Look at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine just, just flopping down flooring like that? <laughs> Man, that would be so easy. Double exposures. You know I like Godzilla. You've asked me that one before. Godzilla is cool. There we go. That looks so much better. Open concept now. Open concept kitchen. All right, let's see. Let's fix these tiles. Fix these tiles in the kitchen here. Doop. <laughs> All right, now let's see. Uh, no, I don't want, I want these. Well, those are not the right tiles. They don't match. That doesn't look good at all. What is the problem here? Uh, 194 out of three. I wonder if, I wonder if they want me to replace all these tiles. I bet that's what it is. I bet I need to replace all these tiles. Oh no, no, don't replace the good tiles. Grr. Oh well, I won't be as cost efficient. Boop. <laughs> Here we go. Double exposures. Yes, we can play as God Godzilla sometime. I don't know about today or tomorrow, but sometime we can uh, we can play Godzilla. Yes. Maybe one when, when one of these days we'll have a uh, a Roblox stream, and we'll load up Godzilla. Uh, let's see, I need to buy those tiles. Here they are. <laughs> Mrs. Chip would love this game, huh? Man, I. Mrs. Toucan, I don't think would like this. She she's not into video games at all, <laughs> so I don't think she would like it. But it might be fun. We like watching these house flipper shows on TV, but I don't know if uh, I don't know if she'd be into making the video game <laughs> or playing the video game. Uh, let's see. There we go. And then we'll just scrape all these old tiles off. See, where's the cleanup from these tiles? Oh, I'm just going to scrape right up past the, the, the light switch here, too. <laughs> Never mind all that. This is just kind of a fun little vibey game, you know? It's got a vibe. I don't know if I like the light switch being right in the middle of my tiles here. <laughs> okay. And then I need to buy these tiles again. Here we go. Oh, I can make these bigger too. Oh, oh, that's, man, that's so much easier. Yeah, that, <laughs> that is so much easier. Now, is this light switch actually connected to something? Turn on, turn on, off. I don't know, I can't tell if, I, I can't tell if it's actually connected to that light switch or not. It probably is. All right, what else do I need to do down here? There's some trash. Where's the trash? There's no trash in here. 
Let's use my flipper sense. No, there's no trash in here. Ugh. Oh, that's trash upstairs. I don't think that's what they were talking about, though. Four out of ten. <laughs> well, thank you for that. There's more to vacuum in here, too? Ugh. All right. You know what? Before I do any of that, I'm just going to... I'm going to buy this paint. And let's paint the walls. I bet... I bet I need to paint the ceilings first. And let's see. I bet I can... Uh, oh, yeah. I can make it bigger, too. Nice. <laughs> oh, no. I'm getting on the wood. Oh, it comes off the wood. It just fades. Okay. I wish painting were this simple. <laughs> If you've ever painted your own house, it is not that easy. <laughs> Especially if you get paint on places you're not supposed to. Oh my gosh. You know what though? The painting in this game is much easier than the first house flipper. Uh, okay. There, that looks much better. Oh, do I need to paint all these walls? The same color? Let me see. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. We got to paint all the walls the same color. <laughs> there we go. Nice. <laughs> oh, I got the floor too. I hope. I hope that's okay. We'll find out. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all about taking my uh, or taking uh, shortcuts here. Oh, but it, it's totally painting over the wood on the bottom. That's not good. Or maybe it is. Maybe that's what they want is to paint the wall on the bottom. I don't think so. Can I can I undo the wall or the paint? Is there a paint remover? Hmm. Let's make it smaller for this. There we go. And then I think we can paint in here. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> no kidding. I wish it did work like this in real life. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Uh. <laughs> hey, that looks so much nicer. Yeah, if it worked like this in real life, my house would look a lot nicer. <laughs> Uh, man, a little extend a roller like that. I just don't want to get the 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 bottom the 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 baseboard painted. Oh well. Oops. It's nice to get inside the windowsill here, though. I wonder if I can paint the actual like the frame, the window frame. Let's find out. Because these window frames definitely need to be painted. Nope. I can't paint the window frames. Or at least redone. We need some new windows in the win uh, in downstairs here in the living room. Here we go. <laughs> Extendo roller. Uh-oh. Uh nope. Here we go. There we go. <laughs> nice. Uh, I think I might be out of paint. Nope. Just paint right over the top of the w the light switch. That's okay. <laughs> Oh, chocolate drive worked worked on a house with the painters that painted over the windows because the contractor didn't pay them on time. Ouch! <laughs> That's not good. Painted over windows are no fun. I've uh, lived in homes where the uh, the landlord had painted over the windows because he didn't want the uh, owners actually opening or not the renters. He didn't want the renters 
painting over, or I'm sorry, opening up the windows. He wanted the windows to stay shut. So he painted over them so that they wouldn't open anymore. He was, uh, he was kind of particular. Not the best landlord. <laughs> That's okay, because my roommate and I... Oh, that looks so much nicer. My roommate and I actually got into a wrestling match, and uh, he, he put me through the window. <laughs> I actually ended up breaking the window. I replaced it. I replaced it. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> that was fun. Ah, uh, see, let's paint this back side of the wall, too. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, Jed, King Jed, what's going on? What, what's, what, what, why are you upset with life, man? I know Chunko Drive is your guy. I know you're here to talk to him, and that's cool. But, man... That's a pretty, pretty uh, strong statement to make there, bud. Cleaning up all this trash on the porch. Ugh, all this green gunk and mold. There we go. Got more of these books. I wonder if I can just throw these books in the trash. Let's see. <laughs> uh, no. No, I can't. There we go. It's probably a safety measure. They won't let me throw away the tutorial books. You know? Okay, so it's not looking... Oh. <laughs> yeah, it is. I'm going to say it's not looking too bad. We might almost be ready to start putting some furniture in it down here. But uh, maybe I want to go upstairs first. What's down this hallway here? Oh, gosh. More junk, of course. Uh, let's see. Can I sell this stuff? I can. Sell the tires. Uh, like, again, I don't know who wants to sell this. Uh, or who wants to buy these dirty old rags. But uh, whatever. Uh, I don't like the way that this washing machine is positioned. Doot, doot, doot. What? What is this behind here? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and a little lobster. Hello, little lobster. <laughs> I shall put you on top of the washing machine. There you go. <laughs> what is this sign? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Can I get back here? Let me see. Yeah. Oh. Ah, ugh. No. I can't. Can't get back there. Huh. That's weird. It looks like there should be something else back there, but I don't see anything. Ugh. There we go. We'll put that down right there. Uh, nah. I don't know. Is there anything else to do in here? It doesn't look like it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like paint and slop and sludge all over in this bathroom. Yuck. All right, let's see here. Let's start selling stuff. <laughs> Who's going to buy used uh, used toilet brush or used plunger? Nobody, I tell you. Nobody would buy that stuff. Yuck. Uh, a shower? Okay. I guess the shower is no good. This rag is no good. Let's see, but the uh, the the vanity is okay though. Looks like I need to clean off the window though. Zoop, zoop, zoop. Double exposure toucan. What would you rather do, a Godzilla or a monster truck stream? Uh, you know, if we're doing Roblox, I think we can do maybe a little bit of both. Uh, King Jed, I'm sorry that you missed the RRC family gaming stream, dude. I'm sure I need it. I missed it too. I need to get whoa. 
this trash just came out of nowhere. Hello, floating trash. I need to get on uh, the RRC Family Gaming stream one of these times, and I don't, I don't think that's a reason to hate life, though, man. <laughs> it's, it's okay. Absolutely. I <laughs> Let's vacuum this up. Here we go. Vacuum up all the trash. I don't know where the trash came from. It just uh, appeared out of nowhere. It's weird. In my nice living room here, too. Ah, you know what? Doesn't look half bad. Let's see. What else? What, what do I need to do? I need to sell something. It looks like there's a... Oh, there it is right there. I see it. Boop. And then I need to buy all that, and I need to paint. Ooh, a blue color. Nice. Okay. Ah, I need to paint just up here. Okay. I don't... I want to make sure I don't go over the tile like I just did. <laughs> oh, I can set... Okay, let's, let's do this. I can set up borders. Whoops. Yes! Oh, that is so much nicer. Okay. And then I can just go like that. Nice! So I'm not going to paint over the tiles. Very good. That's so much better. And then let's cancel out. There we go. And then I can uh, set the border. So now I'm not going to paint over it. Oh, that's so nice. Come on. Oh, I must be out of paint. There we go. Oh, yes. There we go. Now I don't paint over the, the tile. Like I did there. I hope they don't ding me on that. <coughs> Excuse me. I got something in my throat. Let's see. I think I'm done painting. Chuckle Drive. Yeah, I did. I put up a Lego video today. Um, it was fun. I hope. Um, I hope everybody likes it. I enjoy making those Lego videos. I enjoy playing Lego 2K Drive. I've been noticing that the reviews are kind of um, negative on it because it's got some uh, microtransactions that people don't appreciate. But I think if you just stay away from the microtransactions and just play the game, I think the game itself is a lot of fun. I agree with the microtransactions, you know, especially because they're targeting kids. It's probably not so good. But like I said, the game itself is a lot of fun. Oh my goodness! Look at all this trash in here. <laughs> oh jeez. They have absolutely thrashed this place. Oh! <laughs> ah, excuse me. I'm gonna guess that that is paint. Or rust all over that bathtub, but that is gross. <laughs> oh, yuck. Uh, oh, maybe I can clean the tile that I just painted. That's a good idea. Let me see. Let me try and clean it. <laughs> no. <coughs> oh, man. Why am I so coffee right now? I wonder if I can... Put some new tiles over it though. I don't see a way to buy the tiles that I need. Wait, did I just see go to the store? But oh, up here, store. Okay, let me see if I can buy some tiles. No, where's it? I just see paint. I need tiles. Tiles. Huh, I don't see where I can buy. I don't see where I can buy tiles. Hmm. I'll have to look into that later. Like, if it's not part of the quest. Like, here, here's all the quests that I need to do here. Oh, there's still a stain that I need to clean somewhere. <laughs> where? Ah. Uh, I don't see any stains. It's here in the hallway, though. I'll just... Oh, right here! <laughs> there it is. 
Okay, now I think the hallway's all done. Yeah, see, the hallway's all done. So if it's not part of the quest, I don't see where I can buy it. But, uh, oh well, let's tackle this messy room here. Oh, this looks like a repo. I think you're right. I think you're right. It is a, uh, a short sale or a bank repossession. Absolutely. The people did not want to leave this place. I need it. I need to sell stuff to get this place cleaned up first. Choo -choo. Sell the, the rusty old bed frame. I guess there's, there's a buyer for pretty much anything out there, isn't there? <laughs> some, some rusty old beaten up piano. Take the board. Oh, that's not a window. I thought that was, I thought that was a window. Uh, or maybe maybe it was a window at one point, and they just put they bricked it up. Gosh. <laughs> oh, double exposures. Let me see. What is my favorite game? Like my favorite favorite game. Oh, Super Mario Brothers. Super Mario Brothers 3 in particular. Like that one brings up the most nostalgia for me. Like when I was a kid, I remember I remember sitting playing Super Mario Brothers 3 for hours and hours. I love that game. <laughs> Chocolate Drive, two cans building and construction services. That's me, baby. <laughs> Oh, sell the tub, sell all these benches, uh, and then I'll get the trash can out to throw the rest of this junk out. Uh, what what else is there to, to throw out? There we go. Oh, so much junk. <laughs> These trash bags can hold a lot of stuff. That's good. Sell the plants. Why not? Sell the random ferns growing on my balcony. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Hey, this looks so much better already. Trash, trash. Mario Kart, yes. Oh, I love Mario Kart. I remember playing Super Mario Kart, or not Super Mario Kart, just Mario Kart. Mario Kart 1 for uh, for the Super Nintendo. I totally missed that. <laughs> I, I did not play basketball games, can you tell? <laughs> but yeah, I remember playing Mario Kart in the living room with my brothers. Oh man, Mario Kart was so much fun. And then I remember playing Mario 64 uh, on the N64. I played that with my friends. I mean, we had all kinds of... Uh, fun with the N64. I played GoldenEye and uh, Star Fox and oh man so many so many nights spent playing on the N64. <laughs> I still you know I enjoyed playing Mario Kart 8 on the Switch um, but it just wasn't the same you know I tried playing with my boys and it just wasn't the same. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't have the same nostalgia that I did when I played the old Mario Kart. Maybe I'm just too old. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, you have twin boys? I have twin boys too. What do you know? <coughs> My boys, their favorite game to play on the Switch is um, Smash Brothers. They'll play Smash Brothers all the time. That and Zelda. Zelda Breath of the Wild and the new one, the uh, Tears of the Kingdom, they played that one a lot, too. Let's vacuum this glass up. And we'll clean off the walls. <laughs> Roblox and BMNG. Oh, look at that nastiness up there. Oh. <laughs> Double exposures. You love Roblox. I mean, that is that is a very popular game these days, Roblox. And you know, I think because it's uh, pretty accessible, easily to, to, to play on a mobile, and it's free. And there's all kinds of stuff to play on Roblox. 
The only problem I have with Roblox is that uh, there, you have to really be careful about what content you you download and play on it. There's some there's some stuff on there that I don't really approve of, but you know my my boys are old enough now to know and have better judgment as to what to play. But when they were younger, I always had to watch them and make sure that they were on the right stuff on Roblox. But it is it is good. My boys are uh, 11, actually. They're gonna they're a year older. They're gonna be 12 in uh, August this summer. <laughs> Chocolate drive. Your daughter's playing the new Zelda daily. That's awesome. <laughs> you know, I had thought about playing it on the stream uh, or on on, uh, on on the channel on Two Cam Plays. But a everybody and their dog is playing Zelda Breath of the, or uh, uh, Tears of the Kingdom right now, and uh, two, my boys took the the uh, the Switch and they're not letting me play it. <laughs> they uh, th whenever there's a free moment they're playing it, and it's summertime so they need something to do too. So yeah, they're playing Tears of the Kingdom a lot as well. I got I maybe played it put about an hour into it, and I, it's fun. I enjoy it. Maybe one of these days I'll uh, I'll play it on this on the channel, but uh, for now I'm I'm content letting my boys play. Double exposures, you're 11. That's awesome, dude. <laughs> oh man, look at all this trash out here. Stuff to scrub. Graffiti. So much. Uh, these leaves don't want to come off. And this looks like it needs to be replaced. I'll get to that later. Let's see. Hey, you know what? It's actually looking like a livable space now. See, double exposure? That's what's fun about this is... Uh, oh, I need to sell this. Ha. <laughs> Is, uh, you know, you walked in and it was so messy and dirty. And now it actually looks like a place you could live in, you know? That's what's fun. See, Jennifer, yours just turned 10 in May. That's cool. Um, King Jed, bro, I need someone to play with in Monster Jam World Finals 19. Cool. Okay. Uh, summer break starts June 30th in Canada. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Uh, so here in the U.S., we have a Memorial Day, of course. That's at uh, the end of May, like May 25th or something like that. And that's uh, that's that's the start of summer break here in Texas, anyway. I know there's some parts in the country where they start uh, summer break a little earlier or, and or later than that. But, yeah, we, we start pretty early. But then we go back kind of early, too. We go back uh, the first week of August, second week of August. Something crazy like that. It's It's very early. All right, let's see. What else do I need to do here? I need to paint. Okay, let's paint. Uh, what do I need to paint? The wall here? What do I need to paint? 49 squares. I need to paint with this, this color. Huh. I don't see what I need to paint. I think the wall looks just fine. <laughs> Maybe I'll figure it out later. Oh, there's a little bit I need to clean over here. Got it. Uh, what what do I need to paint? Huh. Oh, they don't go back until September. Okay, that's that's late. <laughs> ah, and there's a board over here. <laughs> I'm just catching up on chat a little bit here. Let's see. What else do I need to do? Buy windows. Okay, I knew there was windows in here. Ah, there we go. Oh, that looks so much better with some windows in there. Can I paint? I bet I can paint that. Let's see. Let's get my paintbrush out. Uh, 
Yeah. I don't know if I like that, though. It should be green like the outside. Zoop. I guess it's better than nothing. Zoop, zoop. <laughs> zoop. There we go. Chocolate Drive, you homeschool so it's year round, but once you get your once you get your kids to be self directed, it's kinda of set and forget. That's kinda of nice. So is it like an online program or how does that work? I've I've thought about homeschooling my kids. I was a teacher for fifteen years. Um so it was it was hard, but I've always wanted you know, maybe if this YouTube thing works out <laughs> I can uh I can start homeschooling the, my, my boys. This is what I need to paint. I see now. I actually almost worked for a homeschooling um, company. It's, uh, I don't know. I guess it's kind of homeschool. It's, you know, online. Online K-12 is what it was called. Oh, no. I painted my, uh, <laughs> my crown molding. Oh, well. <laughs> Hopefully they won't notice. Boop. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess you're right, Jennifer. It would be kind of weird. You know, you just kind of get used to doing things a certain way. I, I imagine that would be weird. Uh, doing it a different way. But I, I remember when I first started teaching, we would get, we would get out probably similar, like the first week of June. And then we wouldn't come back until, uh, or yeah, we wouldn't come back until like the last week of August, like maybe even after Labor Day in September. I don't know if you have Labor Day in Canada or not, <laughs> but yeah, we would. We wouldn't come back until later. Uh, but they've they've changed it. They've upped it more and more. I don't know why. That's just something that they've been doing here in Texas. Okay, I gotta figure out where to put this bed. Where's the best place to put the bed? Uh, I'm thinking underneath these new windows. But we have these windows here, too. But that, it kind of sticks out in front of that doorway there. <laughs> Let's put it right there. I think that works. Yeah. I like that. What else do we need to buy? Nightstands, okay. That tracks. Put a nightstand here. And a nightstand there, that works. Huh. Can I, I wanna line these all up. There we go. Oh, look at that. That looks so nice. Yeah. <laughs> See, double exposure. I have a camera shot to reveal myself. Um, You can do a face reveal. Not on my stream, though. You can do it on your own. <laughs> you can do it on your own YouTube channel. Chocolate Drive, you create your own curriculum based on the state standards where you are, or you can purchase curriculums from homeschool com companies. Earlier ages is easier because it's basics. That's kind of cool, dude. But, but is it, uh, so is it pen and paper or is it computer based? First Monday in September. So all the kids go back after Labor Day. See, and like I said, I think when I first started teaching, that's the way it was um, in our districts as well. Ooh, this armchair. This would look so nice right here in this corner. Wouldn't it? Or maybe over in this nook. And you, know, you kind of would have to crane your neck over in that nook. I think I like that there. Um, yeah, I think that's that's what I remember it being when I first started teaching too. But like I said, for whatever reason here in Texas, they've been moving it up earlier and earlier. Part of it is the, you know they want to save money by um, a desk. Where am I going to put this desk? They want to save money because you know here in Texas it gets so bloody hot. 
and they they want to save money on air conditioning, but they still do summer school and stuff like that. A chair for my desk. Nice. What else do I need to buy? Oh, a laptop. Yeah, there we go. Gotta have a laptop on the desk. <laughs> But you know, it's still it's still 100 degrees in September, so or in August. So I don't know I don't know if they're really saving any money. A wardrobe. Where am I going to put this Mamba Jamba? Oh, right here. Oh, it's a perfect place. Yeah. <sighs> Double exposures. If you want to reveal your face, that is up to you, my friend. I will not persuade you one way or the other. Let's see, where's a good place to put a clock? Uh, right above the desk, so you can see what time it is when you're working. A potted plant? Where am I going to put this potted plant? Uh, there's no sunlight there. Oh, eh, we'll put it right next to the nightstand. And we got to put a plant in the potted plant. Is this... No. <laughs> How about this plant? Yeah, there we go. That's better. Uh, right there. Nice. And it clips right through the wall. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, chocolate drive. So for our daughters, they are into coding and robotics. So we only do the English and math and then it's pen and paper, but uh, that is pen and paper. But then they get tutored and take their own online courses. That's cool. They're into robotics. And you know, I wish they had robotic classes when I was a kid. That would be that would be so cool. Uh, my the school I taught at did not have a robotics course, but some of the schools in my district that I was teaching in did, and I was always so jealous of those other schools. I think that would just be really cool. Some of those STEM classes are fun. The school where my boys go to, they they did not have a robotics class. They had one after school, but it was only... Oh, God, I have a mouse for the computer. Uh, they had a robotics course, but it was after school, and then you had to pay like $500 or something. But you got to keep the robot that you built from it, which is cool, I guess, but I didn't... That, for what you got, I just didn't feel like it was worth 500 bucks. So, uh, where to put this vase? I guess we'll put it over there. An accent dresser. Where am I going to put this thing? Oh, yeah. There's a good little nook right for the dresser. <laughs> An ottoman that needs to go at the base of the, the bed. If you guys have any suggestions for where I should put some of this furniture, you let me know. A poster. Uh, poster, poster. Oh, right here. Oh, that looks nice. A candle. Candle. Where am I going to put this candle? On the desk. There we go. Oh, but then they have a lamp too. Uh, there's a there's the lamp. I don't know if I like that candle there. Uh, on the nightstand. Yeah, yeah. I'll move the beginner's book. <laughs> yeah, we'll put the beginner's book on the ottoman, and we'll put the candle on the nightstand. That's kind of weird still, but that <laughs> works for me, I guess. A carpet. Uh, oh, you know what? The carpet needs to be there as you come in from the uh, outside. And then a shelf. Oh, it's a wall shelf. Oh. Uh, ooh. Where should I put this wall shelf? Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Right here? I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that at all. Where's the lighting in here? Is it on? It's on. I think, if I remember, there is this. Yeah, go to that. Turn it on. Ah, oh, that's a little bit better. Oh, can I... Can I go to... No, I can't go to the lamp. The lamp, I guess, doesn't turn on. <laughs> hmm. Oh, well. Uh, 
let's see. Uh, that is so true. We live on the west coast of Canada. Our school doesn't have AC, so it can get hot in May and June, but not all month. So we have a few days of extreme heat. Interesting. Um, west coast of Canada. I've I've been up like to Washington. Oh, I've been to British Columbia and all that too. Um, and it always seemed like the west coast always seemed really nice and temperate. But uh, I, I, it probably does get hot there sometimes too. Double exposures, you're asking people how old they are, man. <laughs> okay, I think this room, this bedroom is done. What do you guys think? I think it looks pretty nice, nice and staged, ready for sale. Let's see what we need in here. We need a laundry basket. Uh, put that right next to the bathroom. A mirror. Where am I gonna put this mirror? How about over in this corner here? There we go. Yeah, no, that's a good place. And then what else? A cabinet? What? Cabinet, cabinet, cabinet. No, I don't like that because that's in the way of the door. I guess that'll work. Well, sure, now the light turns on. <laughs> Started your channel because Little Chip wanted to start a channel after watching Evan Storm and Toucan. Oh, dude, that's so cool. What else do I need to put in here? There's some stains. There's an A stain somewhere. Let's see. Where is this stain? I'll just wash the whole wall. That's so cool, dude. I mean... I don't, I don't generally consider myself an influencer, but I have had a couple of people say that they started a channel because after watching, after watching my channel, which I think is really cool. It's like a, a nice homage or a, a, it makes me feel good. <laughs> it makes me feel like I'm being a positive influence on the world in general. You know, that, that's been my purpose is, is making sure that there's a, a positive and safe place for kids to hang out and watch and and for their parents to know that they can put on my channel and know that their kids are watching something that's uh safe if not um educational <laughs> you know if it can't be educational at least it can be safe let's see here i will flip this around i don't like the way that the spout yeah i'd rather have the spout on the other side that's a cool bathtub what else what is this Oh, I remember this from the first game. So these are like European. This is it's like a radiator and a towel rack all in one. We don't have these in the US. <laughs> and, a, and a toilet brush and a carpet for getting out of the bathtub, a bath mat and a toilet. Oh, it's got to have a Gotta have a spot on the wall. Nope, that's too close to the door. This is like the only place they can go. Uh, I'm gonna have to move this. Let's try this again. Yeah, okay, there we go. That seems awfully close to the tub, but eh. And we'll put the scrub brush right next to it. The toilet scrubber. No, I tell you what, I would not feel comfortable sitting on that toilet, but hey, this isn't for me. This is for somebody else. <laughs> This bathroom is done. Not exactly a, an ensuite, but uh, it works. It works. Let's see. Let me catch up here. Jennifer, we live on the outskirts of Vancouver, so only four minute, 40 minutes from Vancouver. That's cool, dude. Vancouver. Let's see. We took an Alaskan cruise, and it ended in Vancouver. Um, that's pretty neat. I don't know if I'd want to live in Vancouver... Uh, proper, but some of the suburbs of Vancouver look nice. So I'm building the channel and managing it for him till he's old enough to take on the reins for himself. Dude, that is so cool. I, I, that's another purpose that I have is, you know, to leave a legacy for my kids too. Hopefully they'd want to take over the channel. My kids don't are, are, I know this is, I'm ratting them out. They have minimal to no interest in monster trucks they'll go to with the to me to, bleh, they'll go with me to the monster jam events if i took them but they aren't going to be like oh daddy i want this monster truck 
So <laughs> I'm the monster truck fan. Um, so when and if the t time ever comes that they take over the channel, I'm sure it will change directions a little bit. But uh, that won't be for quite a while, I'm sure. Hopefully, knock on wood. <laughs> oh, man. One of your boys wants to be a YouTuber and he would do a Monster Jam or a Lego channel. Okay, cool. Jennifer, I'm glad. I'm glad that I could be there uh, for that purpose. And, you know, that's. There are so few places out there, so few channels out there that are truly safe for kids, and I, I'm glad to be, I'm glad to be that. That is, like I said, that is the main goal that I sought out when I started the channel is to be a safe place for kids, to be entertaining. All right, let's start setting up this room here. I need the sofa. Hopefully that'll work. I don't see why not. What else we got? Oh, we need a table. And I don't think it's going to fit in the kitchen. Uh, let's see. I think I'm going to have to move this. I have to move this down a little bit. You know, again, I, I, we're on a tropical island. Do we really need radiators? <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, <laughs> double exposures, you still want to know how old I am, huh? <laughs> Take a guess and I'll tell you if you're right or not. If I'll tell you if you're in the ballpark. I already kind of gave you a hint earlier in the, in the uh, chat, earlier in the stream. I said that I was teaching for 15 years. Hmm. Accent table, where am I going to put that? Uh... Yeah, sure. Why not? Right there. A TV cabinet. Got to have something for the couch to point at. Uh, right there. And a TV to go on top of it. Uh, right there. A carpet. Uh, right there. As we come in from the... Oh, that looks so nice. Let me come out here. Oh, wow. That looks really nice. <laughs> oh, dude, I just want to sit here and chill. Ah. <laughs> Look out at the ocean. Ah, double exposure. You're not too far off, man. You're not too far off. I am not in the 50s. No, 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 no. <sighs> Let me see. Let's get... Oh, this is another one of these wall shelves, huh? We could put a wall shelf right here. Let's get the fridge in the, in the kitchen. Yeah. Right there. And we'll put the oven right next to the fridge. Do we want to do that? Or do we want to move the oven a little over... I got the window right there. But I know we're going to have to put some cabinets in here, too. Let me see. Yeah. Oh, there's just enough space. And then we can put a stove top on top of the oven. Yeah. There we go. And put more of these countertop. Yeah. That fits. Do we need three? I think we only need two. Yeah. On oh, a dishwasher. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I need the sink. I want the sink right there. Um, can I sell? Yes. Okay. And then I can put the sink right there. And then I think I can move this over. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> and then we can put some cabinets, some hanging cabinets up here. Boop. Do I only have space for two? I guess so. I don't know if I like that. That works. That's nice. Uh, oh, 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 oh. I 
could put a third. Where can I put that? Uh, I don't know. That might be too much. Let me see. I always want more cabinet space, right? As much cabinet space as possible. Yeah. I kind of like that. That works for me. Okay. I think this cabinet needs to go up over the fridge. And then what is that? Oh, that's for dishes. Well, that should go over here. Um, let's see. Doop. Doop. Oh, that's too small. Let's move that over a little bit. Ah. I'm being totally nitpicky here, but what can I say? There we go. Yeah, that way you can wash your dishes and then put them up here. I think I actually want to go down because that looks a little tall. Yeah, there we go. Double exposures. Yes, I am 43. You guessed it right on the nose. That is that is how old I am. I am an old fart. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that that is not lined up now, though. Ah. I'm 43, and I taught elementary school for... Well, okay, so I taught special ed. There we go. Now oh, that, looks, that looks much better, except I want... I want this cabinet. There we go. Yeah, I think I like that better. Yes. It is done. <laughs> no, yes, I am. I am 43. I taught elementary school for, um, for, let's see, taught special ed elementary school for five years at, at an elementary school. Then I went to a special elementary school for kids with uh, behavior issues. And I taught there for 10 years. Uh, I taught both high school for six. And I taught uh, elementary school again for, um, for another four years. And then now I'm doing this. One of my, you know, uh, uh, I don't know if he wants me telling you this, but I'm going to do it anyway. Um, Evan Storm, actually, his dad was was a teacher friend of mine. He taught the same in the same program as me, and that's how we know each other. And so he said, "Hey, why don't you why don't you get into YouTube?" And I said, "Yeah, you know, that's a good idea." <laughs> actually, it took it took me about five years to finally get in, <laughs> finally for him to convince me that I needed to to join YouTube. But here I am. I have finally made it. Nice. That looks pretty darn good right there. Yeah. That's a nice looking kitchen. Let's see. Now we need a couple bookcases out here in the living room. Maybe on either side of the... Uh... Can I fit this here? I can. Nice. Yes. On either side of the TV. Yeah. Yeah, that that's that'll work. That will totally work. And I need a lamp. Uh, we'll put the lamp back here in the corner. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there's trash. Where is this trash? I see no trash. Where is this trash in which you speak? There's no trash. <laughs> Seriously, there's no trash. Oh, there it is. I found it. One little piece of wood underneath the chair or the sofa. <laughs> All right, let's finish up this bathroom over here. I need uh, one of these toilets again. 
yeah, that looks good. Are we gonna put a shower down here? No, no shower. But, but we are gonna put a bidet. Okay, so I don't know how bidets work exactly. I'm gonna guess they wanna be right next to each other though. Yeah, radiator again, one of these towel rack radiators. Let's just stick that right over here. And a cabinet. I guess we don't have enough storage in here. We don't need a shower anymore. No more shower. Is that it? That's it. Oh, that bathroom's easy. All right, let's see. Put this clock right here in the middle. A shoe bench. Uh, let's, let's get these books out of the way. Why are there two light switches right here as you come in? Joop. Joop. I'll put the shoe bench right as we walk in. Nice. You need to have that carpet as we walk in too. Wipe off your shoes. We'll put this with a mirror. It looks like a, a coat rack. Uh, right there. And then a potted plant. Where can I put this potted plant? Uh, right here, I suppose. Um, there we go. Is that it for this room? I think it is. Oh. Okay, so now we've got the upstairs done. Oh, wait. There's stuff to do out here. Ah, oh, man. Okay, let's get this balcony done. Um, King Jed, man, I'm sorry that you're having a bad day. I definitely care about you, but... Yeah, I don't know. It, it seems like maybe you need to talk to somebody, maybe like your parents or somebody, somebody in your family that uh, that can that can help with the the troubles that you're having, man. I don't know if there's much that me or uh, Chocolate Driver are able to do for you. Let's see. We'll buy this wood. Nice. Oh, that looks so much better now. Vacuum dirts? Dirts? <laughs> I guess maybe I vacuum up these leaves. Oh, yep. Yeah, sure enough. <laughs> there we go. Done. Nice. Okay, now the balcony is all done. There we go. Got our, our balcony done. We got the bedroom done. We got the bath and the, uh, I don't know, what is this? A laundry room, I guess? Not really, but is this hallway done? The hallway's all done. This space is done. This bathroom is done. Living room and kitchen is done. I think we just have some stuff to do outside. And then we're, we're done with this house. All right, there's some stuff to sell. What else can we sell here? That, we can sell this whole scaffold. There we go, we'll sell all that. Clean the graffiti off the wall. go yeah there's some more graffiti on the wall all right Jennifer hey you have a good evening too appreciate you stopping by thanks again for uh, for watching with your kids say hi to them from toucan I appreciate them watching you have a good evening
right, let's see. What else? There's some trash out here too, apparently. Ah, there's the trash. This fire pit. Yeah, that we could burn all that, right? I think that was it for the trash. Throw it in the garbage can. All right. Uh, there's some more things to sell, though. Let's look around for the things to sell here. Tree branch. I don't think... I think anything that's out here doesn't count. It just needs, needs to be in here. What else? There's more. I know there is. There's some boards and some plants. Ah, there's the plants. Where's the boards? I guess I'll find them later. Let's see. I think I can fix this right here, though. Let's set the boundary. And then I can... Zoop. 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 <laughs> this is fun. Okay, and then I need to... Oh, no! Oh, no, that's okay. And then I need to buy these. And we'll just plop them in there. There we go. That works pretty darn good. go zoop 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 and then we'll buy some of these here looks like there's some more over here too zoop 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 uh, oh there's the board right there I see it some more of these panels nice and there we go anything else app ah, there's one more over here and I still have some more boards to sell that's crazy Zoop. Zoop. I should have set my borders I'm destroying panels that I shouldn't be destroying <laughs> Buy some more squares. There we go. Anything else? I think that might be it. All right. There's there is though some more things to sell. There's some some boards somewhere. Ah, right there. There's a board. Where else? Where else? There's one more board somewhere. Little duckies having a, a, a picnic here. <laughs> That's so cute. And then a little, <laughs> a little, ooh. <woo. laughs> That's cute. Oh man. Little Easter eggs are fun. What's this? Was that the more board? What? <laughs> hey. <laughs> what is this? Oh, dude. They're like playing Dungeons and Dragons down here or something. Ooh. <laughs> Let me fix your chair for you here. <laughs> How cool. Can I take your board? I totally can. <laughs> That's funny. These little Easter eggs are so fun. Was that my board that I needed to sell? Was that really it? 
No, there's still another board to sell. Where is this board? There it is. I found it. Oh, man. Okay, I think that's it. Got everything done on the outside. I think I've got everything done on the inside. I've got three stars. I think I can finish this job up. It looks nice. This looks so much nicer. Double exposure. What do you think, man? Do you think this looks better now, now that we've uh, fixed the place up? I mean, that's the fun of this, is fixing the place up so it looks nice. Now this looks like a place you'd want to live in. Now, in the full game, I'm pretty sure that you'll be able to sell the house. I don't think you're able to sell the house in this in the demo. Let me see if I can pick up this trash can. I can. That looks better. <laughs> How cool. All right, let me see. Shift, enter to finish the job. Let me take one last look at it. It looks so nice. Completed. Yay. And I got $2,540 from it. That's it. Thank you for playing the House Flipper 2 demo. Hope you enjoyed the experience. Nice. Want to keep up with House Flipper 2 news? Wish list us on Steam. All right. Have a lovely day, the Frozen District team. As always, you can choose to continue the game or go by going into the main menu. Okay. So I think we're going to call that a night, though. This was a lot of fun. Can I? Oh, there we go. Okay. This was a lot of fun. Thank you guys for joining. King Jed, man, I sure hope that you have a better day. I really do. Chocolate Drive, thank you for, for talking with him and, uh, uh, you know, keeping him calm and, and uh, everything. But <laughs> two can remodels for HGTV in the next two months. Yes. At least I'll be watching HDTV for some inspiration for my next house flippers. So this game is not out yet. It should be coming out soon. I, they haven't even put a release date yet, but this demo has been a lot of fun. I hope it comes out soon. When it does, you know, leave me a, a message. Let me know in the uh, the chat if you uh, want to see me play some more of this game. I've, I've been having fun with it. Maybe I'll do it just, you know, every so often for fun, just to, to kind of chill and relax. But anyway, thank you guys for joining. I really do appreciate it. We'll see you guys on the flip side.